everyone, this is Sledhead, and I'm coming at you with my Shave of the Day for today. It's March 22nd, 2019, and I did want to say uh, thanks for joining me for the shave. Definitely do appreciate it. Hope everybody is doing well. Not doing too bad myself here. It's just a Friday. Uh, what's it? Uh, about 4 o'clock. Just afraid to get my shave on here. Uh, going to be going out for dinner with... Well, I'm going to go to my buddy's house for dinner tonight, so I figured I'd get my... Get shaved up, get my head shaved here. I'll do that next, though. Uh, separate video. Okay, so just to get in the shave though, I want to go through some of the equipment they'll be using for the shave. So on the hardware side, uh, the brush we're going to be using, I haven't used this one in a while, I figured I'd go for it. Uh, this is a Yaki brush, it's got this like a black marble handle. It's a 24 millimeter brush, it's like that Poisson style brush here. I got this a while back. So this looks like a new Yaki. Yeah, so it's a 24, I think I got this for about 8 bucks. not too bad. Uh, soft, but not... Kind of floppy, but you know, it's not too bad. The rays are going to be using, uh, I'll be going with the PAA flat bottom ascension. See, it's a double open comb here. I really like this aluminum, very light, but uh, I wouldn't say that's a bad thing. Uh, I really like this a lot. I get a lot of good uh, shaves with it here. It'll be the first time using it on my face since uh, I had a beard. This will be the first shave after I shave my beard off, so we'll see how it feels in the face. I've only done it in my head, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, then I do have a, a Gillette 7 o'clock uh, sharp edge in here, second use, so we'll see how that goes. Very good. Okay, then on the software side, uh, the soap we're going to be using. I've, I've used this before, but I didn't get to use it on camera. That's a Ginger's Garden Winter Solstice. I picked this up around Christmas. She was doing like a stocking stock for a thing. So we got like three of these two ounce soaps in it. And this was one of them. So uh, this is more of like a, a pine, a sweet kind of pine scent. So there's definitely like a fir needle or pine in there with uh, like sugar or something. It's a little sweeter. But kind of like if you smell like a, a pine candle. It's kind of like that kind of thing. Kind of sweet, but you know, you kind of get that fur and all that stuff there. So, uh... Looking forward to using it. It's been a while. Let's see what it looks like here. On the firm side, it takes a bit to get in there, so we'll get a good load on that, hopefully. Okay, and then the aftershave we're going to be using here. Uh, this is the Loyalty Barbershop aftershave. This is from a place that's down from where I live in northeastern Pennsylvania. I figured this would be okay because I do like it. And also, I think, yeah, this list has fur needle essential oil in it. In part of the, uh, the scents here, you know, what's in it? Clove, bergamot, fir needle, lemon. So that's like kind of the scent profile. But I like this. It's a very nice scent here. Beautiful. A little more than halfway done here. So I'm definitely going to pick more of this up uh, when I run out. Okay, so that's some of the hardware and the sock I'll be using. So we can go ahead and uh, get the shave started. So let's go ahead and rock the shave out. Okay, so what I'll do, just unscrew the lid here. Run the brush under some hot water. It's a cold day, so I definitely want to use warm water in. Another reason to use a nice uh, scent like this. I was just actually saying to Shave and Butcher, I was like, oh, pine. This isn't a straight pine, but hey, I guess we'll load up the brush. Get a good look. Let's see here. It's, just, it's a smaller tub, but it's not too bad getting it loaded here. I would say a 24 millimeter is what you'd want to use for this. I don't know about a 26. That'd be probably pushing a fitting that in. Okay, so I, I guess we can go with that here. Let's go around it. Pick up that one. The extra good I'll just put it right on the brush here okay so I'm gonna put a little extra water on it just to get real good okay I'll bring it to the face start uh, building with the lather here oh you know what I forgot I'm keeping chops so I gotta figure out I'm going to go back to chops here. I just got to figure out what they're going to look like and all that.
yeah, so far not so so far so good. Smelling pretty good here. It's a decent centrum. It's really at least mid, maybe a little over mid. Fluff off a little, put that right back in the brush. A little more water here. It's feeling a little bit dry. Stick with that. First time I did a face lather in a while here. Like officially. So okay, so let's get into it. First pass, we'll go with the grain here. Yeah, I gotta say so far. Yeah. It also helps too that I like these blades. The raisin and the blades feel pretty dang good on the face here. So I probably do maybe just one of these. Get those chaps for him. We'll see how it goes. Same thing over here. Okay, not too bad here. Feeling pretty good. Definitely going to be take some getting used to <clears throat> now. But you know what? I feel like uh, without having a beard, like when I had the beard, I could just put off shaving. But without it, you know, kind of like four days with the growth around there, I think that's what I had today. You could tell that you need it. So it's gonna like make me wanna shave more, I think, not having it. So that's a good, you know, kind of get back into the good habits of shaving here. Okay, feeling pretty good there. I'll go back for pass two then, I think. Some water, bring back on. Feeling pretty good so far here. Yep. Pleasant. I do like the uh, scent. I don't know if I'd be wearing it in the summer, but it's winter. You know, it's not too bad. Okay, we'll do across the grain here. Looks like there's a bunch of flying this again. Crap. 
Till this grows in a bit. I don't know where. Where that'll be. We'll figure it out though. Okay, let's work from there, hopefully. I don't know. Okay, feeling pretty good here. Not too bad at all. Getting pretty excited here. East Coast West Shavers uh, meet up is next weekend, next Saturday. Looking forward to it. Not looking forward to the ride. <clears throat> It'll be like two and a half, three hours there, two and a half, three hours back, but hey, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, a little more water. Go back here. I believe uh, Irina, the owner of Ginger Garden, made like a pine kind of scent for Randy over it, polar shaving. I wonder if they smell, this smells similar, I didn't get that one. Just go good on that. I'll do a against the grain pass here. Drama free shave though so far here. No issues with the uh, blade, the soap. Soap is slick. Feels like it's got good residual slickness here, right there, no problems. Can't get, can't wait to get my new blades in the mail. Oh, here, I'm just gonna do this in the meantime. I ordered a 100 pack of Gillette seven o'clock super stainless. And they got sent to the wrong spot. And I think I ordered on the 15th. They were supposed to arrive today from Amazon, but that didn't happen. Now it won't come until this Wednesday. A little longer. I would like, but oh well. When they come, they come. I have blades in the meantime. I just like, I'm just getting those because they're my favorite and I figured why the heck not. I know I like them. I'll go for it. Okay, we'll go with that, I think. 
just feeling around. Just a quick wet lather. Okay. Wet the hand and feel around to see if you need to do the pickups. Nope, no pickups needed. Very nice. Just clean this up then. Yeah, they're looking okay. They look even, let me know in the comments. <laughs> they probably aren't because I have a terrible vision, so we'll see. Okay, and then for the post shave here, put on some of the Loyalty Barbershop aftershave here, you'll see there. Apply some of this. Love that stuff. It just smells great. A nice close shave. Okay, and then uh, while it's drying down, we'll just go through some of the equipment they'll be using for the shave today. The soap. So there's the Ginger's Garden. Uh, winter solstice very nice i like that quite a bit it's a nice pine scent not usually a scent i thought i'd like but uh not too bad the razor the paa flat bottom ascension double open comb aluminum definitely dig that razor it's a nice one the brush the aki 24 millimeter brush here with this poisson style knot a very nice little thing and the aftershave loyalty barbershop aftershave so some good stuff if you're in northeastern pennsylvania try to fix some up Okay, so that does take care of the shave of the day for today. So I did want to say thanks for checking out the video. I definitely do appreciate it. Uh, please like and comment below. I uh, definitely like seeing both, but if you could leave a, uh, at least a thumbs up on the way out, it'd be appreciated. And also don't forget to subscribe. Uh, new subscription is always appreciated. So again, uh, thanks for checking out the video. Hope you have a great night. Hope you have some great shaves.